We are Iowa's most accurate forecast. This morning's showers and thunderstorms in northern Iowa came with the cold front and we had a gorgeous shelf cloud that popped up in parts of northwestern Iowa. Brett Holman sent us this in Lake City, Iowa. This is a scary looking cloud. There was no severe weather, but it certainly did produce a little bit of rain in western and northern Iowa. And then as we expected here in central Iowa, I think I counted three downpours very brief over the station and that was about it. As we head through the afternoon, we will keep some clouds around, but the sun will peek through from time to time. A cool north wind as that front comes in. Still 79 degrees around 1 o'clock and then notice as we go through the day the temperatures will actually be dropping by 5 p.m. We go down to 73, 71 at 7 p.m. for high school football kickoff. So the highs today will stay in the 70s to the north like Carroll and Fort Dodge in the lower 70s there. I still think we'll get to the mid 80s in southeast Iowa in Des Moines right about 79 degrees. It does warm up a couple of degrees tomorrow, but it is going to be beautiful beautiful for Saturday 83 in Des Moines. Most areas in the low to mid 80s and then by Sunday. That's the hotter day. It's really I think our last opportunity of this year unless some crazy thing happens in October to see 90 degrees. It doesn't look like it'll get that warm again after Sunday. So we are going to aim for 90 in Des Moines, upper 80s for most areas, and then it will start to cool off next week. So clouds will stick around again. There could be a stray sprinkle or shower through the afternoon. I won't totally rule out, but the coverage of rain just simply goes away. There may be some additional redevelopment in far southeast Iowa, but the latest trends actually put that in northeast Missouri. Missouri late this afternoon, so I really don't think we will see much of anything else in our state that'll at least be noteworthy. Can't rule out a few more raindrops on you, though. And then the clouds will start to pull away by tonight into tomorrow. That's great news for all of the events that we have going on in central Iowa tomorrow. If you're headed out to the Des Moines Farmers Market, temperatures will be in the 60s in the morning. The mayor's annual ride and run at Principal Park. That's where it starts in Des Moines 66 there at 10 a.m. World Food and Music Festival is all day tomorrow at Western Gateway Park. It's all day today too, by the way, 83 degrees the high tomorrow. And we also have the Southwest Iowa hot air balloon days in Creston. The weather looks good for all of those things. It stays quiet this weekend. Warm air, of course, moving in Sunday. That will be the thing you notice the most this weekend. And then by Monday, another cold front swings in, brings us a decent shot at rain, possibly some thunderstorms coming in Monday evening into Monday night. And then we fall into fall. We are going to see some cooler temperatures next week, going from 87 on Monday all the way down to 71 on Tuesday, and it stays put in the 70s through most of next week. In fact, all of next week. Here's a look at our 10 day forecast sponsored by Holt Plumbing and Heating. We will have some crisp days early next week. Wednesday morning, the first full day of fall, Jackie, we will start off in the 40s.